We're reminded by Tara and Sean that this is a time for love. Love does not delight in evil, but rejoices with the truth. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. And now these three things remain, faith, hope, and love. But the greatest of these is love. I always knew I'd find you. But it turns out I was looking in all the wrong places. My own age group. <laughs> 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 you compliment me, you challenge me, you support me, you drive me, you encourage me. You're my steady piece of comfort through all of life's unsteadiness. I'm, I'm ready to marry you. I'm ready to be married to you. I'm ready to be forever intertwined in name, in spirit, and in thought. I vow to keep an open mind, always. I vow to keep open ears, <laughs> to listen to you, to hear you. I vow open communication. I make a vow to be like you, to love with the whole heart like you do, to be compassionate like you, to be supportive in everything that you do like you are. Not everyone gets to say this in their wedding vows, but you're an absolute stand-up father. Our girls are so blessed to have you. I cannot believe I get to wake up beside you every day, and I will cherish every single one I am afforded. I used to worry that I wouldn't get enough days with you. What I discovered is one day with you equates in worth to a thousand days with someone else. I love you with all that I am. I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love. That I am choosing to share my life's journey with you. And that I'm choosing to share my life's journey with you. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. With a pledge to love you today. With a pledge to love you today. Tomorrow, always and forever. Tomorrow, always and forever. Sean and Tara, you have pledged your faith to each other in the company of many friends and two great families. By the power vested in me by the state of North Carolina, I now pronounce you as married. Sean and Tara. I feel so blessed to be able to be part of your story. You two have created such a beautiful family and life together, and I'm so excited to see what's ahead. I'm confident it's going to be amazing. I love you both almost as much as I love Sutton and Halston. Congratulations, you guys, to Sean and Tara. I met Sean, he's the very first person I met when I moved to Greensboro. And I see this engagement as me not losing a brother, but gaining a sister. I love you too. <laughs> I'd 
admire the way you love your family, and seeing you as a great mother is not news to me. You have long had passion for food, sports, and friends, a passion for living that has no ends. Sean, in many respects, I have gained a son, and to my advantage when it comes to food, you will not be outdone. <laughs> to you both, we are also proud of what you have become. Today, as we celebrate, a new journey has begun. God bless you. Here, here, toast to Sean and Tara.